Hello friends, welcome back to the Family Fun Club. My name is Bradley Weaver. Now you may have heard me mention a hundred times or so that I've recently launched my ukulele club, which I could not be more happy about. So this episode will continue our celebration of all things ukulele. Today I will be playing all classic children's songs that happen to be super simple to play on the ukulele. And I may give you a few tips along the way. So let's have fun. Well, let's kick things off the way I kick off almost every single live show that I do. I like to joke with my crowds that I have to make sure everyone's happy enough for us to continue with the show. And spoiler alert, they always are. This tune is called Happy and You Know It. And if you do want to play along at home, uh, in the show notes you can click on a link and get to a download of a PDF file which has the lyrics and chords to every song I'm going to be playing, including this one. So, Happy and You Know It. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it and you really want to show it If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet If you're happy and you know it and you really want to show it If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet If you're happy and you know it, bark with me if you're happy and you know it, bark with me. Rough, rough. If you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, bark with me. Yip, yip. If you're happy and you know it, do a dance. If you're happy and you know it, do a dance. If you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, do a dance, and I'll do a big finish here. Happy and you know it. I think we're all happy enough to proceed. Well, all right. This next tune, I believe, is such a great children's song for several reasons. The first being that it's just a lot of fun, and that is really what it's all about. The second reason is that it's a counting song, so we're going to get the kids counting from 1 up to 10. And then the third reason, at least when I do this live, it gives the kids an opportunity to come up with rhymes for each of the numbers. So we're going to be doing a tune called This Old Man. This old man, he played one, he played knick-knack on my drum with a knick-knack paddy-whack. Give the dog a bone, this old man came rolling home. One and then two. What rhymes with two, y'all? How about, gotta go with shoe, right? This old man, he played two, he played knick-knack on my shoe with a knick-knack paddy-whack. Give the dog a bone, this old man came rolling home. One, two, three. What do you guys think? Tree? All right. Oh, this old man, he played three, he played knick-knack on my tree with a knick-knack paddy-whack. Give the dog a bone, this old man came rolling home. One, two, three, four. I don't know exactly what knick-knack is, but it seems like a door would be a great place to play knick-knack on. This old man, he played four, he played knick-knack on my door with a knick-knack paddy-whack. Give the dog a bone, this old man came rolling home. One, two, three, four, five. All right, aren't a whole lot of rhymes for five, and this is the one I've always been taught since I was a kid, and it might be a bad idea, but we're going to go with hive, as in beehive. Oh, this old man, he played five, he played knick-knack on my hive with a knick-knack paddy-whack. Give the dog a bone, this old man came rolling home. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, I think I've always done sticks for this one. 
Oh, this old man, he played six. He played knick-knack on my sticks with a knick-knack paddywhack. Give the dog a bone, this old man came rolling home. One, two, three, four, five, six. That brings us to seven, y'all. We're getting there. Now, I have always <laughs> been taught this verse ever since I was a kid was knick-knack up to heaven. But you know what? I like to think that we've got a friend named Kevin. And again, whatever knick-knack is, it might be fun to play knick-knack on Kevin. He's a good sport. Oh, this old man, he played seven. He played knick-knack on my friend Kevin with a knick-knack paddywhack. Give the dog a bone. This old man came rolling home. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven... Eight. That's right, eight is after seven. I don't know, let's go with gate. Seems like it'll work. This old man, he played eight. He played knick-knack on my gate with a knick-knack paddywhack. Give the dog a bone. This old man came rolling home. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, we are almost there. Nine. Well, if you're going to play knick-knack... You like to play knick-knack, you probably like to do it all the time. It's a close enough rhyme, it's what we call an off rhyme. Oh, this old man, he played nine, he played knick-knack all the time. With a knick-knack paddywhack, give the dog a bone, this old man came rolling home. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh. Ten double digits, here we go, our big finish. But we're gonna pretend that we're just gonna do it all over again. We're gonna play knick-knack once again. This old man, he played ten, he played knick-knack once again with a knick-knack paddywhack. Give the dog a bone, this old man came rolling home. Another big finish here. This old man. Oh, while I'm thinking of it, I should do a joke. Uh, last episode, I got so caught up in doing the tunes that I completely forgot to throw a joke in there, so I apologize for that. But this one should make up for it, because it is the greatest joke of all time. Okay, maybe not, but I think it's funny. What side of a turkey has the most feathers? What side of a turkey has the most feathers? The outside. You're welcome. The next song I'd like to do is called Row, Row, Row Your Boat. If you're familiar with this tune, and you probably are, you know that it sounds best in a round. Now what a round is, you have a few groups singing together, and the first group will sing the first line, and then move on to the second line, as you do. But when that group moves to the second line, the next group will start with the first line, and it winds up sounding pretty cool. Now I am out here recording by myself, but I'm going to use a bit of studio trickery to get the second group in there. So here is Row, Row, Row Your Boat. Row, row, row your boat gently row, down the stream. Row, row, row your boat gently row, down, row, the stream, row, row, down the stream. Row, row, gently down, down the stream. Down the stream. Down the stream. Down the stream. Life is but a dream. Really, really, life is but a dream. Row, row, row your boat. Gently down the stream, your boat. Gently down the stream, your boat. Gently down the stream. Life is but a dream. Life is but a dream. <laughs> well, that is my version of row, row, row your boat, and my version of a round. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope you have some fun with the tune as well. I'd like to introduce the next song with a little fun fact about it. This is called Are You Sleeping? And like most of you, I learned this song when I was a little kid. And for some reason in my head, I always pictured it as a little girl singing to her, her little brother John, who was probably sleeping a little too late and was going to be late for school. But it is originally about a friar, or, which is a type of monk, and therefore brother in the monastery. They call each other brother. And he is late for his morning prayers. So this is Are You Sleeping, Brother John? The other fun fact is this song originated in France. So the original lyrics are in French. 
And although I don't speak French, for some reason when I was very young, I learned the French version. So I'm going to do the English, the verse in English, and then I'll do it in French. And a third fun fact about this song is there is only one chord involved. The chord is F. So if you are playing along and you know your F chord, you can uh, strum this one out and be a rock star for everyone around you. This is Are You Sleeping, Brother John? Are you sleeping, are you sleeping, Brother John? Brother John, morning bells are ringing, morning bells are ringing, ding, ding, dong, ding, ding, dong. Frère Jacques, Frère Jacques, dormez-vous, dormez-vous, soma le matina, soma le matina, Din din dong, din din dong, din din dong. Frere Jaca, are you sleeping, Brother John? Well, let's do one more tune here, and I want to finish with just a fun, upbeat number. This is called Skip to My Lou. Oh, skip, skip, skip to my loo, skip, skip, skip to my loo, skip, skip, skip to my loo, skip to my loo, my darling, all right. Oh, there's flies in the buttermilk shoe, fly shoe, flies in the buttermilk shoe, fly shoe, flies in the buttermilk shoe, fly shoe, skip to my loo, my darling. in here. <laughs> One more time. Oh, skip, skip, skip to my loo. Skip, skip, skip to my loo. Skip, skip, skip to my loo. Skip to my loo, my darling. Another big finish here. Skip to my loo. All right. Well, I want to thank you guys so much for hanging out with me yet again for another episode of my family fun club. Please tell some friends about us so that the next episode they can join and have just as much fun as we're having. And if you want to check out my ukulele club, if you've been thinking about learning the uke or you uh, know a little bit about it but want to be part of the community, please check out the link in the show notes. And I would love to see you inside that incredible community. Now, the lullaby I'm going to leave you all with is the first track from my first lullabies album, Lullabies for Hank, and this is called Please. I hope you enjoy it, and I'll see you all down the road. <laughs>